Well, you know, we're in the countdown for uh, the uh, 2023 uh, Sales NBL, and here is signing number one, Braden Inger. <laughs> Welcome back, brother. Thank you. No, happy to be back. I think, yeah, excited for the year. Excited for the year. Yes. Oh, yes. And, and look, we've all got a wee bit of a point to prove, I suppose, after last year. Tell, tell us how that sort of feeds into some motivation looking for the year ahead. Yeah, for sure. I think, obviously, we didn't do as well as we'd like to last year. Yeah. So I know, personally, myself, had a chip on the shoulder and want to bounce back. From that, but also bringing in a bunch of dudes that have also probably have chips as well as like Guy as well. So I think we're all coming in with the same motive and the same like drive that we can all push each other. Yeah, I like the sound of so, that. So, so tell us about Guy Malloy. You know, yeah, you've obviously had some had some yarns. What, what's your sort of thoughts? So, yeah. Great to get a guy with that sort of skill set coming in to I guess pick up off uh, yeah. you know Bevo last year. No, definitely. I think you know keeping that top tier standard of bringing in like that kind of coach is something that I think all clubs want and stoked that we got a dude of that calibre and just from the chats with him seems like awesome dude he takes on like myself and other players thoughts and stuff like that so I think really that's what you can ask for as a coach until we can get him out of the court really yeah totally yeah. Ah, nice mate now we, we talk about uh, the off season you mm -hmm. you had a bit going on trip yeah. of a lifetime and you put a ring on it well done mate congratulations yeah. thank you yeah, yeah. so we went travelling four months through Southeast Asia yeah which is good so it was a bit Strong Instagram game. I mean, you know, look, yeah, no, <laughs> high level, high level. What was the highlight of the trip? Oh, Apart from obviously popping the question. Yeah, so, yeah, did that in Malaysia. Yeah. Um, probably the Hajiang Loop in Vietnam. Yeah. So like a three day motorbike trip. Something like 2,000 feet in the air, which is pretty neat. Yeah. And then did diving and stuff like that in Bali, which yeah. was up there too, actually. Yeah, awesome. Okay. And talk us through the engagement. Yeah, yeah. So, um, plan, so, you, so you planned it out or was it spontaneous? I mean, how did this go? I think mean, if you ask George, it was a bit spontaneous. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, just in yeah, Kuala Lumpur. And then just, I think I'll save the details. Yeah, let's not go into the traffic detail. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> now, well done, mate, too. Actually, am I, am I right in saying you've been pulled into some of the steel training uh, pre season as well, too? Are you, are you, are you a training body? Yeah, I got looped in for one or two little <laughs> drills. <Yeah. laughs> Use the height. Yeah, nice mate. Not so much a skill set. <laughs> hey, so between the young and the start, obviously you boys are out there scrimmaging and, and starting to get uh, you know a core group together from a local point of view, which is awesome yeah, yeah. too. So, so getting into it, feeling yeah, good. Yeah, definitely. So I get the ball rolling, get a bunch of young dudes in, and obviously a few of us older guys that are still in town, and just kind of teaching the young dudes some good habits and good vocab with different plays and just general stuff and obviously the fitness side of things as well is massive. Um, but I'm pretty excited, he's a good local young talent this year which is I think pretty awesome. Yeah, cool mate. Hey, that's all awesome, stoked to have you on, you know, we've got you out number one for, for a reason mate, so uh, so that's awesome and we look forward to getting into it. Eh? Okay, sweet, sounds good.